I believe that the education system is obsolete. Hi, I'm Nolan Bushnell. We're at the offices of Brain Rush in Santa Monica, California. In college, I was pursuing a degree. I got a job summers in an amusement park. I imagined that I could take the computer and mash it with an arcade and have a business. One day a cheap computer came across my desk and that became Atari. At Atari, at one point in time, we had a 90% market share. I mean, we, we owned the business, really. But by that time, uh, I'd sold to Warner. They had deep pockets. Once we sold the company to Warner, Almost the first thing they did was dismantle the creative culture and set up a huge bureaucracy and hierarchy of people, many of who didn't play games at all. Steve was an employee. You know, I always felt that creative, passionate people could always find a place in my company. and. I believe that there are millions of Steve Jobses in terms of creativity and passion out there, but the corporate culture stifled them. My book, Finding the Next Steve Jobs, is really about creative cultures. And I believe that if we create a more open creative culture, a lot of these Steve Jobses will emerge and create wonderful things. And if you can have kids grow up creative and passionate, the rest of it almost doesn't matter. Creativity is actually the linchpin of future success, along with passion. I also have eight children, and so I've been very passionate about what it is to have a creative child. School today really exists as though the internet hadn't happened. There are so many things that they're being taught that are totally irrelevant. For example, reading lists in high school have no science fiction. Zero. It's like they're preparing kids for life in 17th century England. Textbooks are static, and our world is not static anymore. Most kids are totally disengaged in a lecture within 10 minutes. And I got thinking, when they're disengaged, it's like they're not even in class. There's got to be a better way. One of the things that we found very early in the video game world was how good the games were at maintaining attention. And it turns out that game dynamics really accelerate learning. We think uh, as we refine our systems here at Brain Rush, all of a sudden you're teaching kids 20 times faster than a classroom, 20 times faster than a book, 20 times faster than a movie. And the key is active. The minute you ask them to make a decision, to think about it and then come back with an answer, everything lights up. And so we take testing and homework and play and lecture and mash it all together into what we call play. We call them brain rushes. They're basically a very small encapsulated piece of knowledge. In our absolute alpha test, we found kids able to, in Spanish vocabulary, end up with 10 times as many words with less time. Technology it's really about inventing the future and making all of our lives more prosperous. Just think what happens if everybody is a lot smarter, you know? It's just got to make the world a better place.